All right, welcome back to One Bar and Lepagus Show. I am Lepagus. An absolute horseshit news coming from Vikings camp. Uh, our worst fears have been confirmed. Makai Blackman does tear his ACL, and he will be out for the entire 2024 season. We'll talk about the latest depressing news that hit the Vikings here in a second. Before we do, be sure to subscribe to the channel, like, and comment. 12K by opening day. And this just is an absolute kick to the nuts. Uh, Makai Blackman. Tearing his ACL, non-contact injury. You fear the worst when you hear this, but you, you kind of have a little bit of hope. Last year, Tristan Jackson, they thought he tore his ACL. Somehow he's back. He's hoping this is what it's going to be with Makai Blackman, but no, it's been confirmed. It is a torn ACL, and he will miss the entire Vikings season. I mean, this sucks. Let's just talk about it from Makai Blackman's perspective. This was a kid, good rookie year. You know, It didn't look too big for him. He was thrust into some big spots, played well. Yeah, he had some mistakes, but a guy who was named – to um, all rookie teams last year, I think by PFF, he was on a couple uh, breakout candidate lists for the 2024 season. For a guy that you know who's going to have a big part of this defense in the secondary to miss his second season, it just sucks for his development. It sucks for this team. It sucks for this defense. It sucks for everything. This is the one thing you don't want to happen in the preseason. Uh, this is why they cut back the the preseason games. The practices, you don't want anybody to get hurt and happens to the Vikings the first fucking day. This sucks balls. Absolutely sucks balls. Um, let's just talk to it from what it means for the team. This is a team, uh, uh, just a position here, a position group that's already lost Kyrie Jackson tragically. And now you have Makai Blackman, uh, tearing his ACL out for the year. The Vikings are going to say, I'm sure KLC is going to come to the podium whenever tonight, tomorrow, and, and say next man up. I mean, that's the mentality you got to have in the NFL. So who are the next men up? I mean, he just bring in Duke Shelley, Andrew Booth Jr.'s shots, making this team all of a sudden just skyrocket as well. You go, go down a little bit further here. You got, you know, Jay Will, Jalen Williams. Let's not forget about him. Uh, A.J. Green the third, Nooney McLaughlin. Those are all guys the Vikings are going to need to have to step up and, and play up because Makai Blackman was probably going to be either starting on the outside or going to be your nickel corner slot guy. Uh, I mean, unless Josh Patel is playing that role. But he's he had a key part of this defense, and now it, you're looking for – you're looking for someone from the bottom of this thing to move up. So will they bring in a new face? I don't know. I don't know if they will or not. Um, I felt better about this cornerback group when Makai Blackman was a part of it. Now it does make you a little bit concerned. I mean, you got Shaq Griffin. You got Byron Murphy. Caleb Evans has experience. There's Andrew Booth Jr. You hope Duke Shelley uh, can play the way he did when he was brought in in 2022 when he won everybody's hearts. Uh, and Nudie McLaughlin, he's an undrafted free agent, but he does have some upside, does have some size and some length to him. So there's still some hope on this depth chart, but this was a major, major, major kick to the dick. And uh, it's absolutely heartbreaking to see Makai Blackman, uh, you know, go down the first day of practice, the first day of practice. Um, again, it just sucks. And uh, hopefully this isn't an omen for the Vikings 2024, 2024 season, but uh, not off to a great start. So let me know in the comments what you think with Makai Blackman uh, tearing his ACL and being out for the season. And who, in your opinion, is going to be the man to step up and fill this huge void left by this uh, most unfortunate of injuries. And uh, also keep your skull in your home.